Yo, Fuego Beats back with uh, Kiki. Hey. And. Hey, Ravens. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah, and Dirk. <laughs> and Dirk's on the line, too. Oh, by the way, uh, so Dirk, all right, real quick, off off the whole music thing, um, what 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 football team is your squad? What's your favorite football team? Who's your I'm just playing. I'm just playing. <laughs> Yo, I think I'm older than you, honestly. You are older than me. And, and Who we, says that? How you know? When were you, I, what, what year were you born? Down to Virginia. We're not even going to get into that. I'm not 35. And I'm not 30. I'm not. No, none of that. Okay. So, anyway. Moving oh, right on along. Mo- Peter Warwick. <laughs> I'm just trying to think. I know he's older than us, but he was in. He, he was playing there when uh, Dad was in. They were both, they were both like vying for that you know that starting position, and Peter Ward held it down for a little while. He started buying it up, oh, and Theo came to Theo. I don't um, football is not my my favorite joint, so I don't I don't even know who you're talking about like that. I just I just look at yeah, Giants. Peter you know, Ward is he went to Florida State? Are you kidding me? No, no, the name from, sounds no, no, the name sounds familiar. I can't oh, picture his face because I'm thinking about Warner Heisman. Your kid, you you got it. Come on now. I All right, well, maybe I remember him so well because he was cute. But I, he oh, was Lord. Nice, so. Let's definitely move maybe on. Maybe that's fine. Um, <laughs> yo, Dirk. So, um, <laughs> so how many, um, how many, uh, mixtapes or albums you got so far out right now? I have three. Three. And, and what's those names again? I have. I have the end of the beginning out. I have one track mind out. Oh, shit, I have way more than three. I'm tripping. All right, I have the end of the beginning out. <laughs> I have the end of the beginning out, one track mind out, flying doom out, nights and days is out. Yeah, nights and days two is on the release right now. So. Okay, okay. Uh, now, can I ask you a question oh, about flying doom? Like, where'd you get the, where'd you get that name? I like that, by the way. Yeah. You like that? <laughs> yeah, I like that. So, when people, when people, when people ask me that and I tell them the answer, they get disappointed because I'm just like, yeah. But um, this is the answer right here. Um, the, all the instrumentals, half of the instrumentals are produced by Flying Lotus, and half of them are produced by MF Doom. Oh, okay. oh. Yeah. <laughs> the, oh, all right. No. <laughs> no, but I mean, you would have never thought about that. Exactly. It still sounds very cool, so it really doesn't matter. Yeah. Um, now I know. Thank you. I thought you was gonna get all deep on me and stuff, like um, real deep and stuff. And but it's, it, I like that though. I like the name and I like the concept. That's what's up. That's definitely what's up. So where where can we get these uh you know mixtapes and all that at? You can get them at dirt.bandcamp.com. You can get them at Twitter, 
dot com slash dirt car artist. You can get them off of that piss if you search for me. Um, you can get them at, on my Facebook page because I post them on there. D E R K, just capital D E R K. You get there. Um, you can get the songs on my Tumblr too. Tumblr dot com slash dirt the artist. <laughs> Everywhere. Yeah. I love this place. My boys right here. You know what I'm saying? I'm with my man Coach there in Boston. It's Adele. We just chilling right now. Oh, that's what's up. Tell them I say hi. Tell them I say hi. Hi, college boys. I'm joking. No, I'm college boys, though. You're funny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, when you get, you know what? You'll, you'll learn that that's a good thing. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's better. It's better. I'm going to tell you, people give you a whole dip. Yo. Matter of fact, Dirk, did you see? Are you you just put me on your you, you got me on Facebook, right? We Facebook yeah. friends, right? I put on Friday, right? I the way I dress, I like to dress down. I don't like all you know wearing suits and dressing all fancy. I I just I'm a Tim's <laughs> jeans and a hoodie. That's what I like. So I'm there. Oh, I'm at the train are. station. Go ahead, I'm, I'm rocking that, right? So then, oh, this girl that's been asking me, and I'm calling her out now. She'll know who she is. She, I'm not gonna say her name, but she she wanted me to do stuff with her friends she, when I when I had my shooting stuff on, right? Cause and they was calling me they was calling me college boy a lot, you know some of my you know some of the boys they would kept calling me college boy and and, and, and businessman and all this shit, right? So she was all in my face. She every time I see her, that's the way I gotta dress for the nine to five. I gotta dress up. So I'm doing that. She gave me mad respect. I go right. up to her with the hoodie on the other day. She ain't knowing who I am like that. And I'm noticing this. And she's giving me an attitude. Like nasty. <laughs> like I ain't nothing. Like I'm nothing. Then you got people asking me, so so what high school? No, no, no. no what they, ask, they ask me something very stupid. Like as if I'm a, I'm a dropout or something. <laughs> right? Aww. So for the people to know your, your college person, or went to college or go to college is a great thing because it's a level of respect that people give you. As stupid as it is, don't get me wrong, but that's the, the that, and I don't even think it's a color issue. I think it's just a respect yeah. issue because that's just the way it is. But she she played herself. Like, I'm, I'm still going to rock with her friend because her friend got talent. But you, because you had me think you was cool, like he was a nice person. But you just looking at me because you think I got money or something. Cause exactly. what I was wearing. You, <laughs> you see what I'm saying? And the more you tell people of what, like, cause my next question to you, Dirk, I was gonna ask you your major. I'm a mass comm major. Okay. That that is something that people, it, they're gonna be like, well, what do you do with that? What are you they're gonna question you to death on that? When I tell them my degree, all they see is dollar signs, and I don't even use my degree like that. You know what I mean? But the fact that yeah. when you tell somebody. Oh, I'm in IT. They they say they hear a ching ching, and they don't have no more questions because they figure, oh, he's probably one of those IT engineer type guys, and he does this, that, and the other. When in reality, I don't even use it, and they don't realize like, your your major. When I told people that I might, I was thinking about doing that. People actually looked at me like I was stupid, like I'm not gonna get a, a gig with that. But that's stupid. There's so much you can do with that degree. Exactly, and not only that, if you're already, like, you're you're trying to rap, you're trying to make it, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying, doing what you're doing, but you need to know how to communicate. If you're not, if you don't know, people without no talents, and not to say that you don't have to, you know, major in communications in order to be a good talent, but at the same time, if you're really looking to do that, you need to know how to communicate. I would certainly reconsider it, especially, like, as a minor, it's nothing more, because you do need to know how to do that. And mass communications at that? Especially if you get a little bit of video production up in there. Oh, yeah. oh you are all right. You are like you got a good a good a good program. I, I personally was just trying to, you know, so my parents didn't get on my nerves anymore. So I, I just picked whatever I was like whatever because I would have actually studied, you know, audio and sound. That's what I would have done as far as my 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 everything. But you, you know, my parents said no too. Well, my mom was just like, uh. -uh. That's not, you know, you might not get a job. You know, you know how that goes with that. But now nah, it's, it's, yo, if you stay focused, Dirk, I know you're going to be official with everything you're doing. I know for a fact. And um, we're we going to definitely help you with, 
all the all the stuff. Anything you need, just let me know what's up, and we can make it happen. Indeed. For and sure. you keep doing what you're doing, and please finish school. Will you for me? Oh, I got you. No worries. Okay. Even if you, even if you rap and you, and no, I'm serious. Even if you rap, you make it big. Everything else, just at least finish school. Cause all of these niggas out here that got these, you know, rap degrees, when the rap is over, when that 15 minutes is done, they don't have no jobs. Cause well, they don't have no education. Let, they don't have nothing else to do. And let me, and, and let me, let me like jump on that real quick. You know, I'm not gonna hold it up, but I, I wanted to, <laughs> I wanted to talk about the fact, the fact of that. Like that's so, like true and important. Not only, Mm -hmm. I mean, because if you make millions, the thing about education that I tell people is not, I mean, it's not about, I'm not going to say it's not the education part. It's not, it's not even about, you know, getting into the field that you're talking. It's just when you learn, when you're going through college, you meet different people and you learn different ways about doing different things. Like my thing is not, you know, I didn't learn. I can't say that the college taught me all about my information technology and all that stuff. But I did learn a little bit because you learn business in there too. Everything you're gonna learn a little bit about business in every most most majors now, especially what you're doing because you can flip it into a business of yourself. You know you don't have to work for nobody. You got to know how to read contracts and know what shit means and know how to understand. I'm not saying you have to have you have to be a lawyer and understand it that deep, I but you have to have a concept. Out the middle man, exactly. Exactly. And, and you don't have to pay somebody else. And you'll hit because you'll. That's what I'm saying. You don't have to pay anybody. Just pay yourself. And that's what I'm saying. That was our advice. That was our advice for 2012. And that's all. That's why I said I ain't going. I ain't going. That's all I wanted to say with that. And right. That's, that's all right there. But they but, probably like, damn, they try to school this shit. You know, they try to school this shit. Nah, but son. Nah, for son. So, I mean, you got anything you want to, you know, you want to shout out anybody? Anything you want to, you know, want to say or what? Oh, yeah. Shout out to my parents, brothers and sisters. Shout out to my nice and days. Uh, and shout out to my nice and days, brothers, culture in Boston. Uh, shout out to VSU. Shout out, <laughs> shout out to the DMV. Shout out to, you know, VSU and all that. And so, yeah. That's what's up. That's what's up right there. Wait, wait, hold on. Wait, wait. What did that person say in the background? Shout out to Trojan. Let's go that. He and I, he and I, she can do that. Yo, y'all bugging. Y'all bugging. <laughs> y'all bugging like out. That. Already, you know, so I'm going I'm to be, you know, posting this pretty soon, this interview. You know, it was a good interview. Um, You know, I, I shout out to, uh, you know, of course, Frago Beats Radio Crew, GBG Music, The Block, all of that. We connected. You know what I'm saying? That's the, yeah. that's the. That's the whole fam. Shout out to Kiki with uh, tell him your info again, cause I get it wrong. <laughs> you know, here we go. Get money on three. It's, it's it's every day with this. It's in my Twitter name. How could it be so difficult? Well, well, I'm saying you you gotta um you gotta hit Kiki up also. I meant to tell y'all, Jamaican lady at hotmail dot com. Hit her up. She'll let you know about all all, all the Caribbean restaurants around. So, uh, I got nah. two in the grill. <laughs> nah, but so dirt, yo, it was official. You know what I'm saying? Thank you for doing the interview. You know what I'm saying? And um, thank you. We're gonna definitely stay in touch with you, man. Oh hell yeah, I got you guys, man. Good. Okay. So all right, we gonna play this last dirt track and uh, say peace out. That's us. NFL Network on the TV, my man Chad, my man own the building, Young Nello, culture on the track, uh, say hello to the fresh kid, breaking necks, I should be arrested, no Khaled, I'ma show him who the best is. Just 
just let go. Swag of a pilot, fresher than November snow. Rapper sweating, got the zero degree flow. So when I spit, people pop collars on their pea coats. It broad no, broad no. You have your legs are kind of sore. Yeah. I'll eat you in my Nike Air carnivores. Strapped up with my Nike socks attached. Cargoes of jeans like a sweater to match. Make girls snap back with the type of cap. Make the jeans go south with a North Face hat. Slap dirt, you're killing them. I thought they was feeling it. Extraordinary. Take a look into my day a bit before bed. I get washed up, chat, penny ten, sleep in the stars like I was sent on a mission. Then wake up with a hangover, but that's not the end of it. Cause when your class is like mine, opportunities are limitless. Get hit to Say hello to the fresh kid. Bring your next. I should be arrested. No Khaled, I'ma show him who the best is. Yeah. Who the best is. Yeah. Who the best is. Dirt. Say hello to the fresh kid. Bring your next. I should be arrested. No Khaled, I'ma show him who the best is. Yeah. Who the best is. Yeah. Who the best is. Gentle kisses on my skin from these fresh fabrics. Passion for my fashion portrays an addict. Whether the weather be better suited for shorts or a sweater, the concept would be clever. That's my endeavor. Brands bang, colors clash, and styles switch. I make a mesh of a mess. Nickname be Alex Hitch. Born to rock, unorthodox, layers of stock. Clothing career, forever working. Born on the clock. Clothes get fitted so they fit into my aura. Essentials of my essence is purer than spring water. A law of a store filled with culture couture presents the constant conundrum, I need more, music's where I'm at it, fashion simply was added, and all of these L's clear my mind of stupid traffic, living in the jungle so my closet is the bungalow, high lifestyle, image never on the low, fresh kid, say hello to the fresh kid, bring your next, I should be arrested, no Khaled, I'ma show him who the best is, who the best is, who the best is, say hello to the fresh kid, bring your next, I should be arrested, and when it comes to fly, I'm the mayor. This is what my D sounds like. It's a banger. I'm lighting up trees, but there ain't a range of danger. Rip through like mystical. No, I'm not a stranger. My shirt's off, but my Malcolm X snap hard. Walk around in my kicks louder than a frat yard. Swag is uncommon. Coats never seen before. Blue army jacket, too smooth like a bowling ball. Pool halls never seen my type of pockets, y'all. I'm not a tool boy, more of a cool boy. The milk stay eyeing me. I feel like a pool boy. Pool sharks can't even hunt on my food, boy. Getting chicken, New York, make you feel like a rude boy. Good girls can go bad as long as you're bad. Yep. I ain't looking if you ain't got that swag. Fresh like a diaper after you clean. Newborns ain't got shit Say on. Say hello to the fresh Dirt. kid. Break your necks. I should be arrested. No Khaled, I'ma show him who the best is. Me. Who the best is. Me. Who the best is. style is always just an extension of you really mm -hmm. so it's just how i be feeling like you know whether i feel like wearing a hoodie sometimes i feel like wearing a suit you right. know sometimes that's how i'm feeling that clean fresh um, i always like having unique pieces on just like from jewelry